For those of you that have been following along, going to do a spear pull update on this small boutilla or boutilla cross that I have here. So you know that center frond turned crispy on me maybe a month or so ago and I kept pulling on it, pulling on it and hung in there and I felt like it was coming out more and uh, maybe a couple weeks ago, might even been less than that, pulled. Totally, it spear pulled on me. But there's a few threads of um, one whole frond pulled out and then there was another one and there was kind of like a few kind of filaments or segments that were still kind of hanging on. Well, here we are today. We had um, some hot weather this weekend. We were in the mid 90s the one day we were at 100 and the week before that we had some days in the mid to upper 80s and really seemed to spur on the growth on many of my palms quite noticeable and this is one of them so I have some good news I get up here let's see there it is so you can see the funk so here's the remaining bit of this one spear here on the left and there's two spears coming out so it's official it's recovered it's gonna be great it's gonna be fine. I'll uh, cut off this damaged one when it's fully out and those next two we'll just kind of leave them. So that is good news. Uh, I do feel it was from the exorbitant amount of rain we had this spring and well below normal temperatures. Our spring was almost almost like our late winter. It wasn't until uh, about a week and a half ago that things really turned the corner for us. The Brahi Armada, I keep jamming that stick in the hole and the hole's way down and there's a lot of gunk. Um, my guess is that this palm is not going to make it, which is a shame because you don't, I don't have too many palms this color, but we'll focus on the good. This little guy has made a full recovery, so that's great news.